Welcome back to the Tool Crib. Today we're looking at Klein Tools 7-in-1 Nut Driver. This is part number 32807MAG. Now I specifically bought this nut driver for a couple of different reasons. So what I'm doing, I'm, I'm revamping my go bag. And my go bag is a bag of tools that I have put together in order to go out and do service calls on equipment that I've installed. And a lot of times that's electrical stuff that I have to just fiddle with. It's, it's just basically tuning in systems. Sometimes it gets more involved than that, but the idea is to put together a bag that has a tool set that is as compact and lightweight as possible, yet ha offers a great amount of functionality. And that's the reason why I picked up this latest screwdriver, uh, which was the Klein 15-in-1 ratcheting screwdriver. I like this for a couple different reasons. First of all, because of the ratcheting mechanism, that's uh, very easy to use. Also, because of the bit storage and a couple of electrical bits that it has included in it, which make this uh, really great for my personal needs. Now, another reason that I pers uh, personally picked up this particular nut driver from Klein is because this one goes to 9 16 9 16 is a common hardware size that I use a lot. It's the head size for 3 8 bolts. And so that was a big factor. It's also magnetic. Uh, we'll see how they integrate all that and how many of those drivers are actually magnetic because that's a great feature to have as well in a nut driver. So let's get this one opened up and we'll see how all this stuff fits together and how well it works. So I'm going to be opening this up. By the way, I can't praise on this thing enough. This is the best utility blade holder that I've ever purchased from Exceed Designs. There's a lot of different utility blade holders, but I love this thing. It's so lightweight, so compact, and gets the job done. So let me get this opened up here. We'll get it out, and we'll take a look at it. Tell you what, let me get all these components put together and we'll come back and now I want, I want to check it out a little bit and then uh, show you how it all works. Okay, so we got this thing together now and I'm gonna show you how everything fits together. So on the outside, you have half inch and 11 30 seconds. Now these are both have uh, magnetic retention in them. So when you pull this out, you'll see that you have your quarter inch square driver and that has a magnet on the end of it, which is easily cleanable. We'll set that one down. Oh, by the way, those obviously they'll flip around and lock into whichever orientation you need them in. Pull this one out. On the other side of this, we have our quarter inch driver. That one also has a magnet in it. And then inside of this one is your 7 16 And then all that will very easily lock back in place. Then we'll pull the shaft out. You have two wings that lock it into the handle as well as ball retention on this one. So they will seat in that handle. So you just get them on there, slide them around, push it down, it all locks in place nice and securely. Take this one out and this is your 5 16 and your 3 8 driver. These also have magnets in them and they are also have the ball retention. And then the final one is the 9 16 which is the most important to me. So you have the wrong size so there you have the 3 8 and the 5 16 magnetic retention the 9 16 and the and the 7 16 don't have magnets in them but everything else does so 7 16 is not one that i use very often uh, 9 16 is a driver that i use a lot but it's not a deal breaker for me that it doesn't have a magnet in there usually i'll probably be setting this as uh, to get off I like the fact though, I'll tell you one thing, I like the fact that it that it actually doesn't because this will allow me to get onto, now I got it trapped in there. Oh my goodness, there we go. So when you have all thread uh, with nuts going through them, to, to be the ability to have that deep set uh, allows you to get down on that uh, on that nut that's on onto all thread. And so it's kind of great that it, this one doesn't have a magnet. And then everything locks back in place, nice and simple. Oh, goodness gracious, Butterfingers today. Flip it around, get to any driver that you want in relatively quick fashion. So this is really great. Now, obviously, because it's an all-in-one, it's going to be a little heavier than what your traditional single-set nut drivers will be, but not uh, more heavy than the whole nut driver set. And it comes in a nice, compact package that's relatively easy to get to whichever driver you want. So this is going to be great for any kind of uh, technician bag. Uh, where you need to, like I'm putting together, where you need to have um, at the maximum amount of tools that you can in the, in the smallest amount of space. And this one definitely fits the bill. This is the Klein 7-in-1 Nut Driver. 
Links will be in, den in the description down below as well as some other client tools that I really like quite a little bit. My name is Ben. You've been watching the Texas Tool Crib. I appreciate you watching. I'll see you in the next one.